In section 6.5, we learned about determining normality using histograms and also the QQ, the quantile plot. So we're going to demonstrate that with two problems from your textbook. And both of these use data sets from the textbook, which we'll access in StatCrunch. So the first one is on the cookies. They want us to look at the number of chocolate chips in Chips Ahoy reduced fat cookies, and they want us to determine whether or not it makes sense that this comes from a normal distribution. So I'm going to go ahead. Um, Remember how we get here from our uh, toolbar. We go to StatCrunch, and then we go to text data sets from the textbook. And the cookies are down here toward the bottom. And so I'm going to go ahead, and I'm going to go to Graph, and I'm going to do the histogram first. Histogram, and I'm doing the Chips Ahoy reduced fat. And we'll just do the, the basic histogram here. And we see on this for a particular variable, it's a very nice unimodal and symmetric distribution. So we're thinking that it's probably reasonable to assume that these, uh, this data comes from a normal distribution. But let's go ahead and verify it by doing the QQ plot. And on the QQ plot, the one thing to make sure you check off is under other options, make sure you show the normal quantiles on the y-axis. And we're going to do the reduced fat. And we have a beautiful quantile plot here. Beautiful, follows a nice pattern, straight line, no other pattern except that straight line. And so we can say that these data, uh, it's, it's reasonable to assume that they come from a normal distribution. All right, let's try the second part of the problem. The second one has us working with the garbage, the discarded yard waste in the data set called garbage weight. So we're going to go back here and we're going to find that garbage weight data set next to the last one. And we're going to do the same thing. So we're going to go to graph histogram, and the yard weight, yard waste is down here under yard and compute. And we notice on this one, not unreasonable, this is a skewed distribution. There's a few observations that are quite high. The majority of them are down here quite low. So we're th starting to think that maybe this is not a normal distribution. Let's go ahead and make the QQ plot, the normal quantile plot. And we're going to go ahead and scroll down and find that yard waste variable. And the reason I wanted to show you this is how you can see the QQ plot, the, the normal quantile plot, really shows us this is not a normal distribution. It's following a pattern, but the pattern is not a straight line. And in fact, it mimics what we see here. A lot of data points here, down here, close to zero. And then we're seeing the skewing. And you see how that's shown here on the quantile plot. So these data, we would not be able to say we can assume that they're coming from an underlying normal distribution.